Please pick a hero. Pain is my blue. There's no time to chit chat. Coming, wait for me. Hey guys, usually in high rank lobbies, people tend to just stick to meta heroes, but sometimes you just feel like playing no meta heroes for a change. And if you're good at playing them, they can still do pretty well, even against a team full of meta heroes. In this match, we are going to have two very rarely picked heroes in high rank games, Faramis and Gord. I personally like playing Gord because it's quite satisfying when you predict the enemy's movement with his first skill. Let's help our jungler clear the buff fast, so he can get to the lethal before the jungler. This one's gonna be good. Once again, I am the number one of this. Ah, binary, right? As long as I don't die here, it's not too bad for us because our team is putting quite a lot of pressure in the top lane. First blood. While they are putting pressure in the middle lane, we managed to score the first blood. Even better because that was their marksman. Their mage is in the top lane. Let's clear this fast so he will lose all this gold and experience. One of the mistakes I see a lot of mage players doing is that after they gank, they don't go back to the lane immediately to not waste the minion wave. Karina panicked. She could have easily just walked away, but she was too scared of the turret. If I go to the left side, I will die 100%. I need to take the shortest path to get under my turret's protection. Because of all the experience Veil lost previously, he's not even level 4 yet. Lolita was just moving towards the top lane. Let's try to counter their gang. They are nothing but some pixel assemblies. We have the number advantage. We should be able to easily trap them here.
Remember, when you're playing the jungler role, don't be too great for kills, especially if it's not even their own jungler. Let's see if I can catch any of their squishy heroes by surprise. Unfortunately, in this game we don't have a tank, so it's hard to set an ambush. Is Lolita Flameshot a new meta strategy that I'm not aware of? This too risky, got a bell. Coming, wait for me. What? That was a costly dash. We should still be able to easily burst down their tank if she gets careless. Both Expert and Gore deal true damage, quite hard to survive their combo. Karina is coming for my nuts, gotta reposition. Very likely, they will try to go for Clint. Let's just use him as the bait. Now Greenjack wants Gore's ball. When you play a squishy, not very mobile mage like Gord, just expect that you're going to be a magnet for Nuts Addict. And this when the opponent makes a comeback. Thing, but 
Now Karina shouldn't be able to approach the Lord. If she does, she will die by Balmont's old instantly. Bell is coming this way, and I don't have my stun. Let's reposition again. There's a good chance somebody will try to attack the Lord before he reaches their base. This is usually the most efficient way to get kills with any mage. Take maximum advantage of the bush. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, consider leaving a like and subscribing.